Hi, this is Dr. Linda Kramer. Are you aware that every thought process that we have, every thought that we have becomes reality? Every single thing that we think we have the power to create. Our thought processes through our synaptic network of our neuroplasticity is innate, which means that it's natural. So if you're injured or you have an injury or an illness at this point, the more we concentrate on that illness, the more we think about where we have that injury, the more we create that injury to be worse, the pain more severe, and it will linger for longer. So what we have to do is to create a new belief system through our synaptic network, whereby we create a new belief that we are what we want to be. So let's just say I've got a sore hand. The more I concentrate on my hand hurting, the more the pain, ouch, oh my gosh, I can't do this, I can't do that. We're creating that we can't do that or we can't do this because we're telling our brain that exact thing. So the more we attack that belief system, the more our brain creates what we think. So if I've got a sore hand, we attack the pain, we attack the fact that it's sore, injured, or we can't use it for whatever reason. And we say to ourselves, you know what? That is not sore. It is not injured. It is not a problem. I will not allow it to be an issue. Now, there's two words that I live by, which are the I am's. I am strong. I am young. I am pain free. I am whatever it is that you want. I love saying I am healthy. I am strong. I am fit. I am young. So you say it like a little rhyme. And I tell myself that a few hundred times every day. Because the more I say it, the more my brain creates it. So if you've got a sore hand, you say, okay, I know that it's hurting, but I'm not going to let that happen anymore. So I say, my hand is good. My hand is fine. My hand is healthy. I do not allow that pain to be within me anymore. You know I've got a broken neck. I should be a quadriplegic. C2, C3 are not connected. I also got di diagnosed with a brain tumour. Don't Google brain tumours, okay? I went into shock. So I had the CT scan that found this MR, um, the brain tumour. I had an MRI that confirmed it. Six months later, I had an MRI and the doctor said, OK, we've got to do another one in six months to see if it's growing. I thought, stuff that. I will not allow that within my body. So I started the I am healthy. I am fit. I am young. I am healthy. I am strong. I am young, I am beautiful, I am healthy. You say that to yourself all the time and the synaptic network in our brain, because this is now science proving the psychology of our neuroplasticity. And guess what? Six months later I had an MRI, no brain tumour. The doctor looked at the report. And he said, where did it go? Now, if you know anything about brain tumours, they don't dissolve. And unless you have surgery, they don't just disappear. So where did my brain tumour go? Good question. 
I don't ask that question because my request was received and answered. I will not have this in my body. And now it's gone. So I am living proof this stuff works. So if you've got a present injury, illness, pain, whatever is in your body, please start saying, I will not allow that to be in me. I will not give this any permission or consent to stay within me. I am healthy. I am fit. I am strong. Keep telling yourself that. I tell people, get post-it notes or little pieces of paper. Write it on there. All you've got to do is say, I am. Put in little dots. Dum, dum, dum. Now that's reverse because it's my camera. You put this around your house. <clears throat> because then you've got to fill in the blank. I am what today? What do I want to be in the in the, tomorrow, in the next week, in the next month? Because the more we practice this, the better it gets. So think about what's wrong with your own body at this point and start to say, I am healthy, I am fit, I am strong, I am young, I am beautiful, I am young anything you want to be I am fit I am put that intention in there put that conviction in your voice and say you know what I am healthy because this stuff works believe it or not so on that note have a good afternoon good morning or good evening wherever you are Stay tuned because there's more coming. Bye. To learn more about your Solistic Alignment, please press the like button and click subscribe. To purchase any of Dr. Linda Kramer's books or services, please visit www.lindaray.info.